This is a video showing how to use the sweep function for the function generator within Pasco Capstown. If you have a interface or a signal generator that can be controlled by Pasco Capstown, you'll have a signal generator icon on the left hand side. If you think that should be there but it's not, go ahead and select on the eyeball at the top of the left hand column to make this icon appear. Once we've clicked on this icon, we can select the waveform. If we click on the down arrow, we can choose between a variety of different uh, waveforms. In this case, I'll go ahead and keep it as a sine wave. Next, I'll select a sweep type. In this case, I'm going to do a single sweep. So it'll start at an initial frequency and then sweep to the maximum frequency that I desire. So for a mechanical system, these frequencies would typically be lower. Um, but if you're, for instance, doing LRC circuits, um, you can set these to much higher uh, values. So you'll set the initial frequency the final frequency, and then, um, of course, the time it takes to sweep through those frequencies. If you're dealing with a mechanical system, please make sure that you allow sufficient time for energy to be stored within your system. For electrical systems, this is not as critical. So down below, it might be most useful to select on Auto, such that the signal gener generator will only turn on when you've started data collection. So once we've done that, we're now ready to sweep between 10 Hz and 100 Hz in 5 seconds.